I must at this point now. I have to buy this bird. It's cheaper than a real one. Welcome back to the channel and today we are shopping in downtown Micanopy, Florida. Let's go. Okay, so we are in a booth here that is 50% off and now you have to watch out because some of these booths are like that and they're always 50% off. So you just kind of have to look at a few of the prices to see if it's really a deal or not. But I noticed these K Finch dogs, aren't they adorable? K Finch is out of California, mid-century era. And these are really well done. And they're beautiful pink. They make these in different colors, different like, like a mint green color, all different styles, all different forms. And you got this little dog here. However, we can't do it because it's $190. So, sadly not. But yeah, this is a little pair of Yorkies from circa 1940 in California pottery. Aren't they adorable? I think so. I have a basket, so maybe I can fill it. I don't know. It's just a little one. Just a little basket. I really like these types of bookcases. It's known as a lawyer's bookcase or a barrister bookcase, but they're stacking, so they're modular. 995 which is a little on the high side but the wood is really good see the quality it's in pretty pretty good shape usually i see these go for between two and three hundred dollars per case and there's three of them here so three six nine so it's about spot on they put on here a like a, I guess a previous sold or somebody else who has one listed for 1150. It's well, well done. But it actually is like, this is a piece, just this top right here, then this section to here, then that one, that one, and then the bottom with the feet is its own section. So it's one, two, three, four, five pieces in total, but three actual sections. And each one of these goes like this. Wait a minute, does this one not slide in? Oh yeah, there we go. And it goes like that. So you could display books and things. I have one of these in the bedroom. No books in it, but <laughs> it's just really great. So, hopefully... Oh, that's nice. This antique shaving mirror, 125. That is beautiful. I like the nice little furniture that is. That's great. Oh, here's another one. This one's $700, Tiger Oak. That is beautiful. Even this radio, 1941, $233. That's really good. Where did my basket go? I just left it here. Luckily, nobody else is here. Just some other booth people adding to their booths. Oh, this is neat. Look at this, I think you put hats all over it. Oh, that's fancy, $95. Well, that seems pretty appropriate. All these little pegs in the mirror. Okay. Oh, look at this thing. Wow. Everybody's on that mirror. You've got the girl and the guy and the babies. Hmm. Oh, and a bull. I think a dolphin or two. Is that a dolphin? No, that's just flourishes. There's no sea creatures. There are some really beautiful paperweights in this glass case. I need to put my basket down because I'm gonna get some. So, first one is this little egg back here. It, see, it's green. That's $10, I'm getting that one. The next one is this one with the dolphins in it, which is very spectacular. For $15, I'm getting that. Oh, actually, I like this crystal cat back there for 15. I'll get that too, might as well. And then also this bird right here, really pretty for 10. I'm getting that as well. So, is there any more? Maybe, I'll, I'll keep looking, I'll let you know. But for sure, I'm getting the ones I showed as long as there's no chips or cracks. But there's a lot of little figurines here. This is cute, but I don't wanna get that one yet. This booth is stunning. Look at this little gal here. She's a pixie and I've never seen her before. $22 and then also there's a $38 one with a little orange jumpsuit. But then look at this Fenton rainbow for 130, this bear. And then of course they have the fairy lamp, the Atlantis with the little koi fish on it. 
and I've sold that one before in a blue variant I think it was like a opalescent blue but they have some really stunning things in this glass case with a little boomerang ashtray with there's a flamingo on it I think 25 and the hippos oh my gosh oh even this horse hair has the glitter on it that's unusual wow they have a really good eye oh my gosh look at this it's cased glass this planter and the form of it's stunning oh my gosh there yeah this is very good this vendor and look look here 55 for the tiny gold fleck lucite wow it's 175 dollars wow that is nice with all the tiles around it and everything it's a two-tier table as well which is just fantastic and these nice little legs oh i like this chair too see how it's like shaped like a butt well i mean a general general butt not any one specific but it's nice how it's just a swoop that can hold a lot of butt here let me see what this uh, the price is it's gonna hold a lot 125 it's an egyptian revival one so about 1920s that's great oh they've got a really look at the dog ash tray that's a do, i think a dachshund or a greyhound rather a greyhound that's nice and the sewing i think a sewing cabinet stool thing the fireplace screen from the 60s oh okay yeah this is a nice little assortment over here good good yeah so my basket's still empty but that's because all of my acquisitions are up at the register because they are from the glass case we're kind of in the wrong season for this all these oranges but this is very unusual look at that i believe it's acro agate i don't but there's not a the logo on the bottom of it it is slag you can see the color variants here but look at the motif on the side the skyscraper looking things very art deco this orange is stunning but it's $65 oh they do have acro agate written on here glows under UV ultraviolet light um, yeah the cadmium in the glass should glow and then they also have some of these candlestick holders but this is a great piece of slag glass as well this ashtray that's neat you're neat for 65 but this to me is so cool this orange especially for you know the fall autumn time with pumpkins and everything you could almost display it like this upside down and then stick something on like you know what i mean of course you know what i mean of course you understand but yeah that's really that's a good one so they're doing 20 percent off so come here get this come and get it they have some nice glasswares though they do. I'm noticing like this Vaseline. Or if you would consider it Vaseline, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. I don't have my black light. Actually, I think it's colored on the exterior because there's this little, see that there on the top? Might have been some color loss, maybe. I think it was externally stained. I think so. Wow. Okay. That's a lot of great glass. Yep, yep, yep. This cart looks, or I shouldn't say cart. I should say basket. This basket looks disastrous with nothing in it. Mm. This mall is so empty. But it's very nice so far. It's very quiet. So we can really look around leisurely now for something completely different and i actually have never have seen these in person but they are like little peekaboo glasses uh, also considered maybe pin up so if you look at the gal you're thinking oh she looks very modest and everything of course she does but all you have to do is spin her around and see oh she has some lingerie on in there where's she going with her bucket where is she going with her bucket? I don't know. But look at this gal. What do we think about her? She's very nice. Oh, wait a minute. What? She's getting married. See her with her little flowers? Mm-hmm. And then we got this one. That's just crazy. $18. So I'm thinking these are like decals that somebody put on these glasses after the fact. 
they're not like they weren't sold like this so they just had some fun a little too much fun Wee. but yeah they're they're like decals i guess they look like they are applied externally and separately do we think do we think maybe <laughs> i've never seen them before very neat I just noticed something that I've never seen before. I have to look at this because it is a ceramic hanging bird. Wow. $40 is not too bad. I'm trying to see who made this. Hmm. Is it Otagiri or is it... I don't know, actually. It looks a little like Otagiri, but it could be anything. Has the airbrushed detail tiny chip up here but I like the fact that it's like a hanging figurine that is really cool for 40 I'm so tempted by this oh my, oh my I almost hit Santa Claus that's okay little guy there's a pair of bowls here they're very yellowed very dirty Santa very but I just own a, this is one of them things I mean, for 40, can I buy it and sell it for more? That's always a struggle to know. Hmm. And how much more? I must at this point now. I have to buy this bird. It's cheaper than a real one. Okay, so the total was about $95 in my little box here. And I think we're gonna go ahead and go to downtown Micanopy, which is just about 10 minutes or maybe less up the road. And it's a nice little area and maybe we'll find some things there. All right, so we are now in downtown Micanopy. This is really neat. So we're actually out in a courtyard. I can't believe all of this stuff is just set out like this. I don't know, it seems inappropriate. Like the weather would take these things away, but Wow. Oh, I like these chimes. Look at this. Oh, the Corinthian bells. Now, these are expensive. Isn't that nice? We'll see how much they want for such a thing. It's probably every bit of three or four hundred dollars. Let's see. Oh, it's only two fifty. Hmm. I'm very tempted by this one. I, I would want like a really big one. This one's larger, but hmm. the bigger they are, the deeper the sound. That's nice. Oh, I didn't even notice this painting on wood. Oh, that's stunning. I should get this for my back porch. I don't even know if it's for sale. Probably not. Wow. That is so cool. I don't think it's for sale. <laughs> okay, so a change of events. I'm actually going to measure my car, my back seat, to see if I can... Where did I park? To see if this thing will fit, because it's only $140, that, that scene. Okay, yeah, so it's $140. This will not fit in my car. It's just a little update. It's pretty far from fitting. But the owner here says that they could get it to me perhaps later in the week so deliver it to Ocala where I live so many of you think I live in the villages uh that's not true <laughs> I, I live near the villages but not in the villages you have to be generally 55 and older for that uh, I just thought I'd throw that in uh but this is really this is actually from Ohio this art here all right so I was sitting here thinking and thinking and thinking and I don't think it's a brilliant price. If anybody happens to be near Micanopy, come, come and get it because I'm leaving it. But it's beautiful. It's just, I think for what I'm trying to accomplish in, you know, the back porch, Lanai area, it's just not really the direction I was going. And that's kind of my problem as a reseller and someone who likes so many different aesthetics is at the same time, I don't necessarily like uh, an extremely amount of eclecticism in my surroundings so I kind of like to stick to a style and so for me I don't think I'm going to which I know it's like a big roundabout, roundabout way of saying darn and no I don't but sometimes life's like that you know you just gotta think it through a little bit it's beautiful but it's okay wow look at this chair 3,500 or equitable offer. What does equitable mean? Equitable? Maybe equitable. Oh, equitable. 
<laughs> I just read it. It is equitable. <laughs> I'm like, I've never heard of equitable. That's because it's not pronounced that way. Equitable. Oh, for the pair. Oh, wow. For the pair, it's only 1500 Actually, though, like, 750 for that chair is not bad. And that one there is, you get both. That's really good. Those are really, really neat chairs. Very atomic. Oh, you have to sit in one chair. You see what I mean? Really? Okay. That's nice. Have a little control bar on the bottom. A control down. bar? Yeah. Oh. If you slide, if you slide it oh. in, it'll hold it. Okay? <gasps> oh. If you're out, it'll make it rock. Oh, I see that now. This is a really neat table. And it has these little roll-out stool looking things. I guess it's like a tea table, but I was thinking what a nice coffee table that would be for the living room. And then you can use these as like little Aren't ottomans. Cool? Yeah, it's very neat. Okay, if I had room, that'd be in my house already. For the price that mm -hmm. you said, for this, it's in big condition. If I had room in my car, yeah. I'd take it, but... I mean, for 350 I it's, know. it's an unbelievable piece. Okay, so I decided not to get that table. I'm like... Once again, why do I need a table? I have a coffee table, but I don't know. I'm very impulsive sometimes. So uh, they, I got this spray. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that logo. Transcend your space. It smells very nice. It's essential oil. Uh, which one is this one? Sage. I want to sage everything now. Sage my face. Sage my space. 